Hello everyone, it's E back with Polished After 60. So guys, today I'm going to be opening up the FabFitFun subscription box for fall. I can't believe that we're already almost here. So anyway, if you're interested in watching and seeing what I got, stay tuned and I will be right back. Hold on. Alrighty, everyone, I'm back. Welcome, welcome back to my channel, guys. Um, in today's video, as I said, I thought that I would open up the FabFitFun box for um, autumn. And the box says, let's see, what does it say? Pumpkin and spice and everything nice. So I went ahead and I slid it open to make it easier for myself. But before I start, I wanted to say that I have a lot of people that are subscribers and friends who live on the West Coast. And I just wanted to say that I am thinking about all of you. I reached out to a few of you, um, Lisa from Peaches Skin Care and Palm Springs Cindy, and they both said that they were doing well. So I continue to hope that that is the case. I know there's a lot of rain out there. Um, to my friends in Hawaii, um, I've been there before. It's such a beautiful and magical place, and it is so sad to see the um, destruction that is being caused by all the fires. So my prayers are with everyone. Um, in those areas. So guys, you know I had, or if you don't know, I had cataract surgery about a week ago, so no makeup for a while, and um, I'm dealing with a little bit of blurriness in the eye that they, that they fixed. Um, they did do the laser surgery beforehand to take care of the astigmatism that I have in that eye. And that hurt. I wasn't expecting that to hurt, but it did. But anyway, I'm healing nicely. I go for my uh, week, week and a half actually, uh, post-op on Friday. This week is full of appointments. But, and then next week I go ahead and do the other eye. I am officially getting older. So, let me not go on and on because that's what I tend to do and I apologize for that to everyone, but I do consider you all friends and I like to catch up a little bit before I start the videos. So, let's go ahead and open this box up and see what I got. Now, I am an annual member, so I get to choose. Um, I had done this box before and I canceled after about three boxes. Um, I didn't always like what they sent me, so I bumped it up to the annual membership to see if um, having the choices that they give me, I like it um, better. I think the, um, the, the cost is about $54 or so, so I think it's worthwhile. Would I necessarily get the things or want the things that they offer? That's the question that I am struggling with. So let me go ahead and open this up. The first thing I see in here is this little, I guess it would be a belt bag. It's in this olive color. I think this would be great for traveling. And I don't think I am going to keep this item. I think I'm gonna put it away in my um, holiday or gift closet that I have here. And um, someone else will benefit from this. But this, I don't remember what the choices were. This was the best thing um, within the choices that they gave me. So. That's the first item. The second item, I, I love candles, so I chose this candle. Um, it's by Free People, and it's in the scent Palo Santo and Patchouli. So let me see if I can open it up and see what I think about this. Again, is it something that I would get for myself? Possibly. Um, I think this one ran a little bit um, high. I think it was like $60, maybe a little bit, a little bit more. It has a nice soft fragrance. I was a little bit scared when I saw the patchouli mentioned in there. I don't necessarily um, 
enjoy that scent, but it's not too bad. Sometimes it can be overpowering, but absolutely, I like the glass jar that it's in. I think it's very um, sleek and um, minimalist, and um, you can burn that in any room and not have it be a problem. And I do think the scent is quite nice. It's not overpair, overbearing, but it's, um, it's a nice fragrance. Um, the next thing I got was, um, let's see what this is, cacao coffee scrub. So um, it's a little pouch um, with coffee scrub. It says get naked and get in the shower. Um, uh, massage scrub over your entire body, leave on for three minutes and then rinse. So this is, um, this is something that I might use, but I think I will put this aside as well. A lot of times what I do, for um, people's birthdays or holidays is I'll make them a nice pretty gift um, gift basket and I think that would be great in a gift basket so that again is not something that I think I'm going to keep for myself but I think it'll be uh, a nice addition to somebody's um, birthday or holiday gift let's see what else I have in here um, this is something that I have um, added to my um, to my subscription box it's the living proof dry shampoo i use this a lot when my hair is a little bit on the limp side or you know and i want it to have a little bit of volume and texture i use this so this is great i think it's 15 dollars if you purchase it through the subscription so that's very good and i find that they have a lot of nice shampoos and different things that you can add to your membership that um, makes it very nice the next thing I got is a bracelet. I do like um, I do like jewelry, guys, costume and otherwise. So I saw this, and it is my birthstone. It's a little cuff bracelet. Let's take a look. It's by Alex and Ani. Little cuff bracelet with these little faux emeralds on the side and that's something that I will keep. Let's take a look at it here. Put it on so that you can see it. I think that's cute and that's something that I can absolutely wear. Um, sometimes these, um, I'm not sure if this is going to do it, but sometimes these bracelets kind of move on your wrist and don't stay where you like them to, but I will give this one a try. I just got a beautiful cuff I will share with you guys in a later video with white topaz, sterling silver, and a little bit of 18 karat gold, and I think it's so pretty. I can't wear, I can't wait to be able to wear it somewhere. All right, so that's that. Um, they sent me some Ricola little throat lozenges. My throat is always dry, so I keep these little packages next to my nightstand at night. And um, if my mouth gets a little bit dry, then I will go ahead and pop one of these um, things in, and it helps me quite a bit. I think I only have one more item. And um, I'm pretty sure that I'm going to keep this. It is. Um, it's like a duffel bag, I believe. Let me open it. I'm sorry to be making noise, but I, you know, I kept everything in the package so I can share it with you all. They have a choice of two patterns, and um, I chose this one. It's by Alice and Olivia, and um, it's a cute little tote bag that you can use for a weekend trip. It has side pockets. So you can put a water bottle, or if you're traveling with it, maybe um, your any documents that you might have. Um, air dot air air. Hold on, I'm trying to see. Oh, you can use the you can clip this in and make it um, make it a different size for yourself. It has a cute little pull with a little girl and sunglasses. Side pocket pocket in the back wall. It has a nice long strap to it, and let's see if there's any organization inside. No organization inside other than a back zippered um, compartment. So this is something that I can definitely use um, when we travel. I haven't been doing much traveling 
um, over the last couple of years, but I do hope that that will change for myself because I love to travel. I just, it's one of those things that I love to do and I have been blessed to be able to do that in, in my lifetime. So I hope that that continues. But that is the subscription box. I have some clothes over in the corner that I need to share with y'all. So that will be upcoming. I, like I said, I can't wear any makeup and I need to steam press those things. And um, I don't know that I should be doing that um, right after eye surgery, but we'll see, we'll see. And um, that's about it for me, guys. I hope again that you're all doing well. And um, I will see you again real soon. Um, autumn is coming up, fall is coming up, and we will be transitioning into fall. So hopefully I will share um, some pieces with you that I think would be great um, pieces to move into the autumn for you all. So again, Thank you for stopping by. I appreciate it more than you will ever know. I consider a lot of you friends. I hope you all know that. And this community is lovely. And I hope we can support um, one another in times of happiness and in times of a little bit of stress or unhappiness. So that is it, guys. Let me um, finish before I just continue on and on. Bye everyone. Have a wonderful day. Let's see if this little clicker wants to work on me. Bye. Nope. Bye. Bye guys.